Hi there, and welcome to my tutorial on how to use the Discord bot Carl. Carl's actually pretty easy to use. The first thing that you need to do is make a message where you want the reactions to go. You can make it as cute as you want, as aesthetic as you want. Then what you're going to want to do, if you haven't done it already, is you actually need to add him to your server. Go to the website and it'll show you a list of all your servers. Click on the one that you want. You'll have to verify, give it all its different permissions, and then he'll join. You can ignore the control panel for now, where it says get started. Now go back to your server and make sure that he's joined. Once you see that he has, make sure that you have all your roles ready. You can make these once he's joined, but it doesn't really matter. Then, in your message, add all the emojis that you want to do. I added these cute little custom Sanrio emojis. And put your role right next to it so that people know which one to click on. You can add as many symbols as you want and make it as cute as you want. I decided to take some of the stars from my dividers and put them there. Just to make it a little more neat and organized. Also, to make them get this gradient look, all you have to do is color them differently. You can slowly slide the color picker over to be able to get them like that. Now, here's the command that you actually have to do. You have to do explanation mark rr space add space hashtag whichever channel you're putting it in. Then you do the ID of the message that you're connecting the reactions to, then the emoji, and then the actual role itself. have to do that for each one. It gets a little repetitive, but you'll get there. If you don't know how to get the ID, all you have to do is go into developer mode, which is in your settings. Also, a very common mistake that people make is that they forget to put the Carl role above all of the other roles. If you don't do that, then he doesn't have any administrator commands and he can't give people the roles. So make sure that you do that. Then test them, make sure that they're working, and you should be set. Thank you for watching!